fun about the road. Wait, um, first of all, we have to make sure that, that Patrick is, well, this is, this is our dear Patrick. Hi, my name is Patrick Jones. He's working in troubles. I'm at work right now and I couldn't be here. <laughs> so, uh, so Ben Shelker picked the most embarrassing <laughs> picture possible. <laughs> And if you really, really look, I'm you can see his tonsils. <laughs> yeah, you can see his tonsils. <laughs> so, Patrick, <laughs> how do you like being in the van? Ah! <laughs> so, Patrick, how do you like working with a guy like Ben Choker? He doesn't. He didn't. Ah! <laughs> oh, stop. You knocked uh, Pat over, God. which isn't difficult. <laughs> Only weighs 10 he pounds. He is, yeah. He is very No, strong. touring. I, I, I love the tour. Thank you. <laughs> Good bed. No, no, I love it. We How like, long have we been in there? Yeah, we like going out on the road. Um, just it gets kind of tiresome after a while when you're in a broken down van. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that? Bad. But it's, it's just amazing what we've done. I think. Like driven to Canada, 13 hours up there, played one show, and driven 13 hours back through a yeah. snowstorm <laughs> in February, yes. two, two o'clock in the morning, driving across the Canada border. <laughs> Where's the road? <laughs> well, I was tired. <laughs> in, the in a car with no insurance, breaking international laws. And the border patrol thought I had drugs because I had a caffeine pill. And they're like, how do I know you didn't like empty this capsule? And, and lace it. <laughs> oh, they said it. He opened it up. He said it was laced. Yeah. Ben had taken one. It was a caffeine pill. And he decided to sell it. Where did you buy it. this? I bought it at a truck stop. <laughs> Which one? <laughs> so, anywho. Yeah. Yeah. We go to Wisconsin a lot. What? We go to Wisconsin a lot. They no. didn't even give us a body cavity search. <laughs> <laughs> Nick was disappointed. Pat, <laughs> 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 speak up, Pat. Go. <laughs> I'll leave him. Leave him alone. <laughs> God. <laughs> Metal retard. Yeah. Yeah. We've been we've been together. Well, those guys were together about half a year before I joined. Or yeah, about eight months something like that. Yeah, know, before we had this other drummer, but he quit because he wanted to get married or something. Actually, yeah. he hated us, and then we got this lousy drummer. In. But I'm still filling in. I've been filling yeah. in for the past three years. We just asked him to fill <laughs> in, and he's been in for almost three they years. They found now. another drummer. So yeah, we told him he's just temporary. Yeah. It's been too long. <laughs> I'm waiting to join a rhythm and blues band. I quit. <laughs> we can't play. I'm going home. <laughs> you are home. <laughs> no. <laughs> can't call this home. <laughs> Don't. <laughs> How do we like being in Dayton? Mm. How do we like being in Dayton? I, I like Prince, being in Dayton. You're born here in It's not like Detroit, and it's not like Detroit, Youngstown. Scary. Youngstown, which is scary. Youngstown. Youngstown. It's Flint. <laughs> Lots of big people that could beat us up. No, we no. We pull we pull up to the club in Youngstown, and and. I was sitting in the van with Patrick Jones, <laughs> and we hear these like four gunshots go off, and so we decided to dive on the floor van while Nick and Grog were in, in inside Safe, the club, safely indoors. Yeah, oh. yeah, and then then me and Pat get a bottle tossed at us when we go to use the payphone outside. <laughs> this cop asked if anybody, you know, threw anything. We decide to say no, and then like we go inside, and the sound guy goes, "Don't worry, all of us pack heat in here." So. Yeah, so. It's kind of like, you don't worry, you know, if you hear any trouble, just kind of duck behind that corner there where you're playing and we'll take care of it. So. <laughs> it's, it's nice knowing the doorman, the sound man, the bartender, everything yeah. will have guns. <laughs> and then we went to Detroit. West Detroit. Detroit. We pulled up. <laughs> we pulled up in Detroit. And, like, I, I got out of the van to check the, the place where we, we go in. I, I get out of the van, we walk up. And <clears throat> I'm looking for the front door. Can't find it. Finally, get to the door. It's like locked shut. So I turn around and go back to the van. There's some guy trying to sell grog, like part of an old newspaper. Actually, it was the next day's newspaper. Believe it, it or not, it was the next day's newspaper. Yes. I don't know how he did that. That's he great. goes, "Here's tomorrow's paper." And he goes, "Give me fifty cents." I'm like, "I don't have any money." He goes, "You're in a band." And then he threw it in the van. Okay, you owe me fifty cents now. <laughs> so. But I was getting very nervous at the time. Because they're looking nice. inside the van going, gee, look at all the equipment. You guys in a band? <laughs> but, yeah, we're clutching no, baseball bats. No, we're, we're an FBI uh, front. <laughs> <laughs> Just kept the keys in the ignition, got ready to play. Any more questions? Uh, what else? What? Do we like being a Dayton band? I think she said something like that. 
You like being a dating band? Too late. I like being a dating band because you don't get lost in like this big conglomeration of what would be like a Athens, Georgia band or a but Seattle of course there aren't band a ton of or band, band. There aren't a ton of places to play, but there also aren't a ton of bands. But so. yeah, <laughs> but the, the places that are to play are pretty cool, except for one, and we're not. Gonna the, well, there's only two places in Dayton, yeah. so <laughs> kind of narrows things down. But well, we, we play at one of them. <laughs> <laughs> the other one we don't really, except for a couple of times. Um, but it, it's nice. We get, you know, all the bands get more individual attention with video and stuff like that here in, a, in Dayton. In the, Valley. in the Miami Valley. In the Miami Valley. The Memory Valley. <laughs> oh, yeah, do we see ourselves staying in Dayton? Do we see ourselves? Yeah, because we're poor. <laughs> 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 yeah, Patrick's giving it the thumbs up. Yes. <laughs> Even though he loves Minneapolis, he wants to be Prince's love child. But I hate Ben Shelker! <laughs> he loves Prince and Bob Mole, so... <laughs> and, uh, and we actually played in Minneapolis. It's lots of fun. Yeah, we played it the first time. We have a 7-inch coming out from a guy in Minneapolis, so... <laughs> yeah. We played it at uh, the 1st Avenue, which is where Purple Rain was filmed. Actually, we played a 7th Street entry. Oh, shut up. We played at 7th Avenue. It's connected to the same building. <laughs> then we played a basement. No, we played at 7th Street. But entry. it was so cool. It was so cool because... <laughs> yeah, I got my new tuner pedal ripped off. That's oh. real cool. No, no. It, 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 was, it was just throwing his distortion pedal on the floor. Yeah, it, was, it was great because we, like, we walked oh, in my. and there was a what, Megadeth or Slayer no, no, no. show going no, on. No, it was... Yeah, we Nuclear watched. Assault. Nuclear Assault was playing. <laughs> watch that. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> no, As we do our sound check in the next room. It's great because we, we walked in and they were playing. And then we go in, we like do our sound check and stuff like that. And uh, Ben and I walked in, we had to talk to the owner about some, you know, the payment and stuff like that. They had this big rigmarole. And Ben and I walked upstairs. Rigmarole. And they... Give me a little. <laughs> and, uh... With your druthers. <laughs> your titty pack. Go titty on with the damn They, story. uh... They, they were still playing. It was all all these, you know, long, real long-haired grog type people. Only they had black shirts on that said Iron Maiden that they probably bought in Spencer's Gifts or something. And uh, and then we walked Ooh, in, we played burned. and stuff like that. We walked back. <laughs> we walked back out, and they were cleaning up, and like. Within about a half an hour, they turned this Megadeth show into like this this hip hop dance the, this or this nuclear assault show into this hip hop dance club. It was a huge fourteen seventy. Yeah, well, yeah, yeah. 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 Two like level fourteen seventy. Yeah, and it weird. was it was so weird the transformation that just happened in about a half an hour. It was a cool place because like you pay money to get in. You could either go to that dance thing or go see four bands, and people just kind of went back and forth. <laughs> and most of the people went and danced. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Well, some people paid attention to us. So. No, but I messed up. I, I mean, like, yeah, it was just, it was, the, the coolest thing about the whole night is we played with the other bands, and, like, people would, like, come in and walk out, and then, like, when we played, we got, like, the there biggest was a crowd, crowd there was a crowd. And people and, came in, and they stayed in, they didn't just And go, all the yeah, bands were only supposed to play, like, 50 minutes, and he let us go over the 50 minutes a couple of times. Yeah, the sound man, he was really <laughs> cool, because he was like, how long, I was like, how long do we have left in the set? And he's like, uh, 10 minutes. Then ten minutes later, how long do we have left? Ten minutes. Yeah, we. How much like, long do we have left? Ten minutes. <laughs> yeah, we played like, like, like right. until Pat smashed his distortion pedal, and then it was like last song. <laughs> <laughs> it's like it's, that's Pat's way of fixing stuff. This guy, something I, breaks, he I throws it. I smashed my distortion pedal in Minneapolis because I didn't get to see Prince, <laughs> and I was very mad. And he didn't get to go to Glam Slam. Glam <laughs> Slam. <laughs> or Prince's studio. Paisley Park Studio. Yeah, that would have been nice. We just went into to uh, Cybertechnics, recorded ten songs for our upcoming CD. Yeah, and we don't have money to mix it yet. <laughs> we recorded that. Yeah, it's recorded. It'll it'll be out someday. Someday, some way, somehow. Yeah. Give us money. Anyway, anyhow, <laughs> anywhere.